Hey, hey, everyone. It's perfect. Thank you so much. Oh, so I am scoping this morning from the back of It's a Grind Coffee Shop in Riverside, California. I didn't even know they had this patio space back here. So welcome, everyone. Hey, welcome. Check this patio space out. It's just beautiful. So, hey, welcome, everyone. It is time for Twitter Scope. Hey, welcome. I am actually scoping from, isn't that kind of pretty? I'm scoping from the back patio of It's a Grind Coffee Studio in downtown Riverside. I was just here for a meeting with Million Cups um, and it was fabulous. I thought, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and scope from here because this is the best background. I may have to come back here. My name is Dawn Carter, Descartes. Every day I'm here at 10 o'clock Pacific time uh, to give little Twitter tips to push back the veil of ignorance that surrounds Twitter. I don't know if you have this experience, but I have this where I have friends who join Twitter and have um, not ever activated it or they think it sucks. Um, I'd be here to help give one little tip each day to help push back the veil of ignorance that surrounds Twitter. So if you guys are here and you want to share this out, go ahead and swipe right on iPhone or swipe up on Android and share it out so other people can um, learn as well. And let's get started. So um, where's everyone from? If you are new to Periscope, you know, you can type in the comment down below and let me know where you guys are joining from. Um, if you're catching on the replay, sorry, I can't know that because you're on a replay, but that's thus the benefit of joining live. So, hey, how's it going? Want to let you know, here we go, Twitter scope. If you have questions, you can, hey, Nancy, good to see you. Here, you, you missed the unveiling of the sign. So is this a great coffee shop? I am scoping this morning from It's a Grind in California, in Riverside, California. I was here for a meeting and I just stepped out so that I could hop in and do the scope. Hey, I think it's pretty beautiful actually, so I love it. So our topic today is on Twitter scope. We're actually on episode, episode, oh, you know what? I forgot to do this portrait landscape. Oh, well, that's fine. I won't change it now. Our episode 43 is how do I come up with content to tweet about? It's Wednesday and every day of the week I cover a different topic. Wednesdays are hump days. Don't go there with whatever. So problems. How do we overcome a problem that is typical, a problem that I hear all the time from people who are on Twitter? How do I come up with stuff to tweet about? I don't want to just, you know, I always talk about shooting pictures of my bagel or something. I don't want to do that. How do you come up with quality content? Well, here I'm going to go ahead. I don't have the cards written out, but I'm going to give you a couple places that you can do that. Number one, Google alerts. Did you know that you can set up Google alerts with a, looking for a hashtag or a keyword? And as articles or as posts come up around that topic, you can actually grab that link and tweet that out. That's one source. Number two, a source like Feedly, F-E-E-D-L-Y, Feedly, I think it's Feedly.com, but Feedly, another good place where you can find things. Clout, and again, these are free, free places that you can find information. Yeah, Feedly.com, thanks Nancy. Feedly is a free place that you can find content that you can send out and you can search it by the, the topic that you want. Clout, for instance, you can put in keywords or industry. So for instance, maybe you're in the dance. I just heard a great talk by um, uh, April McLean, an owner of a local dance studio here in Riverside. Well, so maybe it's modern dance or hip hop. You can search for articles that have to do with that and then send those out. The nice thing about, sorry, hey, welcome, Michelle. The nice thing about having... Um, it automated is that you don't have to waste, not, it's not wasting time, but isn't there other stuff that you'd rather be doing than looking for content? I know I would be. So go ahead and use a source like you can use uh, clout. You can use, uh, and what are the sources you guys are using? If there are sources that you're using to find content, there's another source called Nuzzle. And again, Madeline Sklar, if you're not following Madeline, it's at Madeline, M-A-D-A-L-Y-N-S-K-L-A-R, Madeline Sklar amazing blab she does on Tuesday afternoons called Blab About Twitter. And uh, she was sharing some of these with Adele D. Meyer yesterday. Use sources like Nuzzle. Nuzzle basically will, will um, let you know what are your friends talking about. And that's N-U-Z-Z-E-L. So these are just a few of the ways that you can find good content um, and, and have it float up for you so that you can um, publish that out. Because uh, remember, your Twitter followers are looking to you to be kind of a curator, you hear, you hear that word, and all that means is just a filter. You know, if, if Don found this interesting, maybe it might be good, and that's why they follow you. So you wanna keep that consistent content. If it's too burdensome for you, just post something once a day, but be sure and leave time 
for interaction because that's what the social about social media is all about. So again, that was my one quick Twitter tip with uh, hat tips to Madeline Sklar and Adele Meyer as well for some of the tools because these tools I've learned about from them. Um, but Nuzzle is a great one. I use Clout uh, to, f- uh, to find um, good content. And again, this was episode 43. How do I f- come up with good content? If you have any questions about Twitter, please use the hashtag Twitter scope and I will answer them. And anyone who's been on these scopes will know that if you ask the question, I will take the time out to answer them. So I am signing out from It's a Grind Coffee Shop. Is this amazing? So if you guys come to Riverside, please check out this back patio space. I think this is just cool. And look at all the art too. It's just fun. Anyway, so by, hey, thanks for hopping on, Nancy. Isn't this just... There's just a lot going on here. So anyway, so feast your eyes on the, on the art. <laughs> anyway, we'll see you guys tomorrow, 10 o'clock. Tomorrow is Thursday, and I'll typically go over a small business tip on Thursday as well. So I will see you guys later. And again, at Descartes, let's push back that veil of ignorance of Twitter one scope at a time. And have a great day, you guys. Bye-bye.